Tong à Vai vai Mòn Thì hôn Lê lê mai bằng mẫu cò phê phín hết Ở với phín hết bê cắt Thật cười cầu lô Cô phuộc kể tiêu Mới phá mì đi Cái hẹn hôn Mà lê lê mai Cái phá kì ạ À nào ủ đi ủ đi Ê nốt tự bù lột Kể tê cô ấy I he ta ue u uo uo fu ma ni ma la yan I he ne mo ui Be hum ne fili ko he ahon Ke ho ko Ko hon hu spa ni I he lo to ho nga iya Ni ho ku ma fu Ki ho ma fu A ek fa la la Pa ta wang ke o tua ma fu ma fu Ini datang di mahu. Ini toeng lah kau mau mahu. Pegau falal kakat. Ini akon. Ego ke faka kolor aku ki mahu. Aye nono. Aye otua ma aku mahu. Pegau iya. Kau fakiat. Anau uli uli enos ketekoe. Tong way way mual. Malo albito. Today we'll get married in the rite of marriage. And also as we come together, we bring both families in. We bring families to pray for one another, to build bridges and to help each other, especially their walk in faith. So let us now call to mind all our sins, to prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mystery.
grants you our supplications and more forth the help of your mercy. On these your servants, Father and now willingly, so that in the union of marriage they may be bound together in mutual affection and likeness of mind and in shared holiness. For our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. The first reading is taken from the book of Genesis, chapter 1. Then God said, Let us make mankind in our image, in our likeness, so that they may rule over the fish in the sea, and the birds in the sky, over the livestock and all the wild animals, and all over the creatures that move along the ground. So God created mankind in his own image. In the image of God, he created them. Male and female, he created them. God blessed them and said to them, Be fruitful and increase in number. Fill the earth and subdue it. Rule over the fish in the sea and the birds in the sky and over every living creature that moves on the ground. God saw all that he made, and it was very good. And there was evening, and there was morning, the sixth day. This is the word of the Lord. Responsorial Psalm, Psalm 33. <coughs>
letter of St. John, chapter 4, verses 7 to 12. Beloved, let us love one another because love is from God. Anyone who loves is born of God and knows God. Whoever does not love does not know God. For God is love. God's love was revealed about us. In this way, God sent his only son into the world so that we must live through him. In this is love. Not that we love God, but that he loved us. He sent his son to be the atoning sacrifice for our sins. Beloved, since God loved us so much, we also ought to love one another. No one has ever seen God. If we love one another, God lives in us and his love is perfected in us. This is the word of the Lord. Please stand for the gospel acclamation. my commandments, you will remain in my love, just as I have kept my Father's commandments and remained in His love. I have told you this so that my own joy may be in you, and your joy be complete. This is my commandment, love one another as I have loved you. The Gospel of the take four months now. So twice a week we have seen each other for the past four months in preparation for this. And we talked about time. <laughs> and Tala, who was the one going, nah, I'm going to be on time, don't worry, I'll be there 15 minutes. Oh. <laughs> Broke the record today, buddy. <laughs> No, but, you know, things happen. Uh, Satan tries to come in different ways, so we'll just blame it on him this time, alright? So, I, I tend not to sing, but I got a bad voice, so I'm gonna sing you a song. 
And if you don't know the song, don't sing it, but just do the action, right? So if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. So who didn't clap their hands? No one. What that means we're all happy then, eh? We're all happy. And if you heard the words in our psalm, happy is the nation whose God is the Lord. Happy are we who God is our Father. Happy are we who have been given life from the Father. We've come together to share in the sacrament of matrimony, where two people become one. They leave their own families to join together to make their own family. Now the word that was expressed through our readings today was the word love. Love. Really easy to say, I love you, eh? But do we truly mean it? I love food, as you can tell. Uh, I like people when they come late, as you can tell. There are certain ways of expressing our love. Today, it's a different type of love. Hands up, how many of us are married here? How many of us are married? If you're married, put your hand up, please. Anybody married here? All right then, so the married ones. Leave your hand up if you've been married for more than one year. Two years. Three years. All right then, so. As you can see, the hands are stored up, so these are people with experience. Five years! Stole up. Now let's see, who would be the most? No, 40 years. Who's been together for 40 years? Knock it, honest to you, knock it. 40 years? Knock it, knock it. 40 years, 50 years. Wow, 50, 60? Some have been married for 60 years? So 50 years, 50 years. And is your husband here with us? No, but you'll be married for 50 years. Huh? He's 88 years old. He's 88 years old. And you've been married for 60 years. No, 50. Oh, 50, right? 50 years. So in that 50 years, how many times have you said, I love you? I say I love you, and then when we start to have trouble with each other, another I love you. <laughs> we'll come together to share in your love. You'll see everyone that's taken the time out of their day, out of their busy lives, to come and offer up their time to witness you two, which means you guys have done something for them. You've given also your time for them, your love. You've given them a part of yourself. You've sacrificed your own time to give to them, which is why they're here today. The love that you've given to them is reciprocal to today. Even though now was late, we still love her for being I'm gonna keep saying it until we finish eating. But remember, today you guys are going to be together forever. Doesn't matter if she was late, she still turned up. And as we move into the rite of marriage, you will consent to each other that you have come freely. And then you guys will consecrate it with your promise in front of God and in front of your family who have come here to witness it. Now this love does not, doesn't just finish on this day. It's in the words of itself. Till death do you part. Not until now talks my ear off. Not until Tonga pisses me off. It's to death do you part. Your I love you that you say here takes you to the grave. 
which means you stay together. Why? Because the love is from God. What God has binded, man must not divide. If there is quarrels in between, forgive, forget, and move on. Why? Because love is strong. Love and forgiveness go hand in hand. But also humbleness, self-sacrifice. These are the traits that we've been talking about for the past four months. Love, self-sacrifice, humbleness, and togetherness. Today is about YouTube. It's about your I do's. For two years you guys have been doodling in the dark. Today, you're open to light. And just understand that your role as a couple is like the second reading to procreate and provide for the earth. So in other words, bring children into the world. To continue on doing the, the work and the work of the Lord. But also to understand that you were made by the image of God. That one is not above the other. We were made side by side. So you walk with faith side by side, hand in hand, with God as your foundation. That love that has been founded between you is now going to be consecrated today in witness of God Himself and your family, your friends. So we now ask you to, to come forth now so that your family and friends can witness you, give each other your consent, and your idols. My dear friends, you have come together in this church so that the Lord may seal and strengthen your love in the presence of the church of minister and this community. Christ abundantly blesses this love. He has already consecrated you in baptism and now he enriches and strengthens you by a special sacrament. So that you may assume the duties of marriage in mutual and lasting fidelity. And so, in the presence of the church, I ask you to state your intentions. Toma and Naomi, have you come here freely and without reservation to give yourselves to each other in marriage? Yes, I do. Will you love and honour each other as man and wife for the rest of your lives? I do. Will you accept children lovingly from God and bring them up according to the law of Christ and His Church? I do. Since it is your intention to enter into marriage, join your right hand and declare your consent before God and His Church. I, Tonga, take you now with me. I, Tonga, my wife, Mark, take you, Teresa, who have I, Agnes, now with you, and Nostra Pula. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad times. In good times and in bad In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you all the days of my life. All the days of my life. I now take you, Toma. I, Teresa, Hawaii, Agnes, now the only Enos Tupuloto. Take you, Toma, by my mom. To be my husband. To be my husband. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. And I will turn up on time on my wedding day. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you. All the days of my life. 
all the days of my life. You have declared your consent before the church. May the Lord and His goodness strengthen your consent and fill you both with His blessings. What God has joined, man must not divide. Wedding rings, please. Take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fatality. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. By sealing each other with your rings, Tom, you can now kiss your mouth. Your first kiss in the light.
Lord, we thank you for the gift of friendship. For all friends present here, young and old, married and single, that they may be blessed with health and peace. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. We pray for married couples everywhere, that their lives will be an example to the world of unity, fertility, and love. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. We remember the smiles and laughter of those who have gone before us, who would have loved to share in the joy and happiness of this day. We thank God for the happy memories they have left with us. May God one day unite us again. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. We pray for all those who are sick, lonely, or struggling in today's world. May they be strengthened by God's love and aided by their friends. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord hear our prayer. And we pray for our own private intentions of here or of all here present through the intercession of Mother Mary. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord we also pray to our Mother Mary. We continue to thank her for her own holy and full of protection as we pray together. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Bless her, and bless her, the fruit of thy womb. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us for thee. Now and in the hour of our death. And we make all these prayers through Christ our Lord.
your servant, join now in the holy covenant, that through these mysteries they may be strengthened and love for one another and for you. Through Christ our Lord. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink of it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many, for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. Brothers and sisters, 
who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy, welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be called to eternal life, and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ.
Behold the Lamb of God. Behold, He who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those born to the supper of the Lamb.
for him is always in my mouth. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed the man who seeks refuge in him. Let us pray. Grant we pray, Almighty God, that the power of the sacrament we have received may find growth in these your servants, that the effects of the sacrifice we have offered may be felt by us all. Through Christ our Lord.
now present to you Mr. and Mrs. Moana. Now stand for our final blessing. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you all, the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Mass is in the door in peace to love and serve our Lord. Thanks be to God.